Good evening, good evening, good evening. How is everyone today? Uh, this is Tuesday, the 22nd of October 2019. If you're watching this on the VOD, <laughs> it is the last quarter of the decade. For those of you who are interested in such things, uh, I am eager to play some Path of, Ex uh, Path of Exile, some Diablo 3! We finished our um, current campaign uh, setting in this war of mine, so I don't have to wait till the weekend to keep going with Diablo 3. Uh, I'm still doing seasonal stuff, uh, season 18. Uh, let me just, sorry, while we're live, uh, let me just check and make sure my sound is live. Uh, yes, I did, uh, I did indeed turn on my sound. Um, I'm still doing the season. Um, so on the list for tonight is definitely uh, doing uh, a few of these. So these I think are Ubers, Torment difficulty one or higher. So I can do that. And said dungeon. You can go and try and do a said dungeon. I did check where this one is, the Unhallowed Essence. And Belial Torment 7 difficulty or higher. Also, um, Torment 16 was a bit hard because I tried to do. <laughs> uh, I succeeded. I did do a. Um, what's the guy's name? Greed Vault on uh, Torment 16. But I uh, died a few times to him uh, and finally succeeded when I gave my minion a unity and a cannot die. Uh, thing. Uh, where did I get pick sticker? Ah, that might might have been greed. Um, on torment sixteen, but that was too much death. And I think this um, square's necklace is part of the problem because I didn't read the fine print. So you do hundred percent increased damage, but damage taken is increased by up to fifty percent as well. So uh, he several times one shot me. Um, while I was fighting him and only later realized that must have been the cause because I dodged like crazy and then it gets one attack that hits me and I de I'm dead and it's because I've taken 50% increased damage uh, anyhow um, still got a lot of improvements to do in um, in my setup I also still need I've got a focus so I still need a restraint to get the focus and restraint and then I'll swap this around to get the um, focus and restraint because it gives uh, the set gives me 100% damage if I use resource generating and resource spending attack. Speaking of, let me swap my skills around because uh, this doesn't suit me at the moment. I'm going to switch to the evasive fire and is it this one? Yeah. That generates extra hatred and this one switch back to multi shot. Multi shot over there and arsenal. And Vault can stay there defensively. Uh, I'm gonna switch so it was that yeah, preparation is the one we want. Uh, preparation. Give me some of that, please. Invigoration. And sorry, I realized I was following the wrong build because it's. Uh, I do want a, a T16 farming build, um, but for survivability, I'm more likely to go for the Greater Rift build by Leviathan, which is if you're interested is this build. Um, so let me just check I've got all the right stuff. Thrill of the Hunter, Blood Dungeon, Politics, Ambush, Color Freak. So all of these are more focused on speed. Um, whereas I'm having troubles uh, with survivability. Uh, so let's see. I want Thrill of the Hunt. Cull 
the week. Ambush and ballistic. And there's the squirt damage dealt and taken is increased. I do have maybe this is worth doing. I do have oh I got bombed by this. Um I do have a oh this is my um my first uh, primal ancient this season. Uh whaling host. I've got a couple of flavors of time potentially. Swap it out for squirt. I still need the other ring though, so let's try if we can get a socket on this. Fire scales, or oh. I need better rolls on it as well. Ah, I want the socket first. But it wouldn't be too bad if I get a um, harpoon of the order. I want to get my gold, man. I like I've leveled the others to 25 as well. Bane of the stricken and Bane of the powerful. But apparently the the right ones to go for with this build is Bane of the trap and the Zays. I've only recently got the Zays, so some more leveling to do. Gem leveling. Oopsie. Uh, flavor of time. It might be okay just as is. The other thing I still want as well is in my let's check something quickly uh, inventory. I want oh, I've got twenty one at least of each. Um, I want to see if I can get the so I've got gold wrap in there as defensive stat, but I want this uh, what's it called. Uh, visage of Gunes. You look like you could use. What is it called? Yeah, Village of Gunes. Want to see, Wanna see what that. you'll get? Uh, let's get lucky and get it. What a steal! That will look nice on you. That is too expensive. So what did we get? And Daryl's visage, Yorix crown, Broken crown, and Natalia's sight. Okay. There we go. Oh, I haven't got any. Oh, I do have an Italian. Hmm. That's not super exciting. And Daryl attacks, release a poison nova that deal 447 weapon damage as poison to enemies within 10 yards. I'm gonna go in the list of things to be disenchanted. The visage of Gunis um, is a defensive one that uh, gives my uh, my. Uh, vengeance, the dark hardrune as well, uh, reducing all damage taken by 50. So that's a critical one for extra damage reduction. At the moment, I've just got a seethe, which just gives me more uh, hatred. So uh, let's go and see about doing Ubers. Should be able to do it at this level too hard we can just do it at the easier level. Uh, this one. one of each. 
Right, and I'm gonna hold on to this for a while still. I'm gonna swap now. Because this isn't gonna help in this fight. The, I wanna say, Boon of the Hoarder, so it doesn't matter. Uh, this one. Hold on to that there. Oh, oh, man, okay. Yeah, I'd like to open all of them at once and then and come back. Let's see how it works. Realm of Putridus. Okay, yeah, I've changed my uh, key binding files. This is the top one, this one. I'm um, keep firing, I had multi shot on the left mouse button. Um and so now I'm shooting the wrong <laughs> the wrong damage thing. Mm -hmm. And I suddenly do a lot of damage once I actually switch to multi shot. <laughs> Shannon Bolter. That's pretty exciting. That one and then the one in the middle. Doing way too much damage, man. Because probably because my discipline keeps being so high. <laughs> Feels like I'm doing too much damage. I need to go back. Ah, yeah, this stuff now goes to there, so it's three, three, four. Okay, so I should be able to make about three. Uh, of the Hellfire Amulet as well. And the Hellfire Ring. Hellfire Ring gives you XP as well, if you're interested. You end the achievement of Solus. That was all of it? That was all of them. Hold on. Yeah, that one. Yeah, we got all, all of the ingredients, so 334. Three, Okay, that was pretty quick actually. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Let's get some Book of Cain. Balefire and a Shannon Bolter. Ooh, ancient. Yeah, the other thing I still want as well as, as a focus piece is to get the, um, a couple of extra yangs to try and get a reforged ancient of some sort. This helps as well. Maybe it's the 14% more damage. Yeah, I'm not quite sure. 
And da -da -da. yeah, we ran out of the green stuff to make this. One paragon point. Let me also I'm gonna swap this back around and hold on to this and do a set of bounties and get some more keys. Clear the scavenger stem. Should be able to do this. Need more time. Sweet oh, yeah. revenge. Lots of armor now. Creatures that killed him can't be far. Get to level two. Not ready yet. Darkness awaits you. I'm still here. Kill Tiffany. 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 <laughs> I hear something stirring in the distance. Yeah, I'm a bit slower because I've changed that out, but I'm doing more damage, I think. Oh, kill Tiffany. Do something. I'm also going to need lots of gems for when I do uh, the augment later. Let me see if I can get some augments. That was just a I've never actually played as far into a league where augments actually matter. I, I did look at my profile earlier and I think 660 or something was the highest paragon I ever got in a season. I played three different characters that season. That was season 10, 12, something. Feel my wrath. Kill Sodnob the Forest. Twelve million. <laughs> Prepare for a long fight, that wasn't long. This one gives it bellows. Oh, I haven't got all of them. No. But the village no, is not the village of units. The village is a place in the highlands. No one left to sacrifice. Bone slack at the berserker. Ooh, first lane.
Oh, how many gold am I gonna get here? Come on, Skelly, get all the gold, get all the gold. <laughs> My like toughness looking like 173 billion toughness. <laughs> oh, this gold, man. 42 million. Is that a, a conquest for us? Mm -hmm. 50 million, anyway. Okay. Yeah, I didn't look at the conquest. Um, there used to be one that's uh, 50 million um, picking up in one session, like I just did there. Or in one collectible session. I'm also going to try and get a another uh, Ring of Royal Grandeur that I can put in the cube, because this one is an ancient one. So I don't want to. Um, I don't want to uh, put my only ancient one in there. <laughs> I'd rather keep an ancient one to be flexible in other gears. I become stronger. Consumable. Oh, this is my first one. This is the Ramaladni's gift. I forgot about that one. I haven't played in a while, so it's like. Oh. And then I looked at some of the the stats of other people, and it's like, how how do they get four stats and a socket? Ramaladni's gift. Uh, I need to go back. Your yeah, you? deeds should have finished all the battle. I must make a bit of inventory space. Oh, yeah, there we go. There's a ring. And it is. This is a ring of all grandeur, so. I can put that one in the cube and then we are ready for the um, for getting the we'll focus on the restraint. With you. He'll put you to sleep with all of his blathering. <laughs> okay, uh sanguinary braces. Definitely wanna save this Raman Latnis. Oh. I also want to slow that, but this first. And, ooh, Lord Greenstone's fan. Level requirement reduced by 39. Can I get one of those? Could be pretty good. Um, Lord Greenstone's fan. Yeah, I did look through my um, stash uh, that got mailed to my. Uh, main account, so the non-season account, when I rebirthed this character, and I did see I had about three Primal Ancients so far. And only one of them looks actually good. Uh, Witching Hour is being one of them. Um, yeah, not not any of the others that actually the stats matter, because it's only the really the um, the ones that's got very wide roles, like the 660 Dexterity. Can you press alt or something? There we go. Uh, so you press control and you see the range. Um, and the others, it's only the, the primary stats like dex in that's got big ranges where it makes a big difference. Uh, 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 and on weapons, of course. But 
The apples doesn't make such a big difference. Uh, did put my flask somewhere, if I can find it. There we go. Flask. Some paragons. Okay, act two bounty. Burn the sinker. Oh, right here. <laughs> Bale, who then corrupted the Lord's Stone to devastating effects on the barbarians who lived near Mount Ari. The heroes no, killed Bale shortly afterward. This count? 15 minutes? Help us! You can't leave us here! Okay, that's good. Cool. Prisoners of the cult. We yeah, can actually see, see some of that cage arrows there. We call them Chaldean villagers from the cage. And the thing now does a lot of damage. This I could possibly push it up to. to We will see, we will see. Probably worth just waiting for the... Feel my wrath. Focus on my stream. And it's kind of hidden how much damage I'm taking because I've got the gold trap on. And uh... Oh, look at this thing. Um, yeah, because I've got a gold trap and a boon of the hoarder currently. So... Um, Fairly immune as long as I keep killing some mobs. They will always drop gold and then I get static armor. It doesn't do anything for my defense though, so. Ah, sorry, for my attack. And that's the one that I'm most worried about not doing quickly enough if I switch to 360. But maybe it's also this um, Captain Crimson's uh, damage dealt increased by your percentage of cooldown reduction and this one had extra... Did we get... I've, st oh, I've still got squirts. Did I swap it around? Or did I just actually destroy the one that I had? Now I'm Your fear betrayed you. Let me check that I actually destroy the thing that I like. Oh, this is worth a lot. Okay, yet. flavor of time. Let me check if we still have my flavor of time. I had two anyway, so I could reforge one. Do you want more? Iron cage. Cool. Down to done. I need to. I'm just gonna go back to town because I'm now curious if I actually did do that silly thing. I don't think I would have. Right. I would have just simply put it in there. Oh, where's my put it? Okay, there it is. Uh, okay, I'll come back. Shrine of Rakanishu and Keyboarden. Wow. Long distance away. 
As long as she can start killing something and get some gold for armor. Zilton Kul is the boss, so let's wait a while before we do that one. I've been here alone for a while now. Mind if I join you? Kill all enemies at the protection of the railway. Forgotten okay. Let's go into a little Can't see nothing there. Watch on the <laughs> watch on the stream where I'm going. Seems a bit lighter on the stream. Part of the reason I'm probably not seeing stuff is I've got my um light studio lights that it's right above my screen so the contrast is it's really bright up there and then really dark there so I don't see so well there luckily I chose a good build to just spam buttons <laughs> don't need any skill just a little bit of skill, more experience. Quick bounty though. It feels Maybe my comparison is part of XL with every zone feels so long. I probably need to clear out my pack when I went back last time. But now. Yeah. 
Your deed basket. The light grows stronger within you. Shield, Codem Nightshade, Boots. I am returning to town. The shield, I think, is something I give to my followers to pick it. Oh, he already has one surprise. Mage first covers a criterion 6 of 40 strength. It's actually lower than his cut already. You may move unhindered through enemies. Okay. And put that. I've got that in there and I've got oh, I've got that one. You take 57% less damage from blocked attacks. Mage first fire skill will increase the damage. Okay. Next up is Act 3. Can I do Act 5? I don't want to do Act 5 last. Find the entrance to the cave. Kill 100 enemies and, and kill this object. Neutron's no good. A little bit dodgy, this is the Monday's idol. And the Bound Shaman, Quasar Unspeakable Terror, has been killed by Sporiza. That we want. That is the thing that we want. That's it. Uh, could be, could be. Could be Natalia's as well. Okay, if it's just going around in circles, I will not be happy. If it's going around in circles, I am not happy. <laughs>
and get them before they actually leap those guys. The best way to attack them. I haven't had, as far as I recall, I haven't had a primal drop yet. I saw that it actually drops a, um, like as a red star, which I still want to see. And I'm wondering if it makes a special sound as well. Feel my ride. Shadow Warriors. I'm still waiting. Your fear betrays you. Okay, there's one down there. Yeah, off the bounties, I'm going to do a bit of normal rifting to get some keys. If we can get enough keys, thinking about uh, 25 30 ish, and do some leveling, gem leveling. Let's do this. Three of them. I will then actually do that one. And then one more. It's, this one is now probably on the other side. And this zone is split into two. usually close to the uh, portal area, the waypoint. Move this way. Move this way. Mistaken though, sometimes it is close to the way for Okay, that should be it. Just try to get it. Cursed bone pit and a US the boss. Reached Paragon 559. Enter the repository of birds. You won't survive that. One of those that needs a bit of a running. of bones level 2 as well not just the first level 2 what is that?
At least we are doing that quicker than the last time. <laughs> last time we got a boss fight on one of these chests and didn't do it quick enough. And the chest is timed out. I think I was taking on too much difficulty. Is this the one we want? Oh, it looks like it is on that angle. Is it the right one of the two? Focus, focus, ah. Focus, focus. Ah, this gives us a choice now. Not the right one. We want the other one. The other one. Okay, let's keep going. Commonly called the plague tunnels, were originally used to bury West Marches in the ditch. However, when the plague tested. Oh, this isn't one I have to kill everyone, though, so. I don't have to stop and kill everything. Oh, pretty good. For my, uh, my gold. Kill enemies on this side, and those others can come closely if they want. Even my evasive fire shot actually does a bit of damage at this level. So it's worth keeping. Thirty-six million. Thirty-six million. Do we have enough gold? Do we have enough gold? Forty-two million. Can we make it around the 50 million? 50 million. Are we gonna make 50 million? We are not gonna make 50 million. Maybe in this one. Okay. Uh, da -da -da. And Adria. Let's see if they've got something for us. My question. So this is 8 seconds. Increased damage and the reduced damage taken is. Because you need 10 yards difference or gap between you and the nearest enemy for that to take effect. Does it mean once you are closer than 10 yards it completely stops or that it then starts counting down properly? So if I go and stand close, ah, then it starts counting down. So you still have about 8 seconds left to get away from them to reset the count. Darkness awaits you. Need more time. Not ready yet. Dead end from no more time. I've got a big uh, pickup radius though. Very small pickup radius to be fair.
Just come down the rack and just pop up. Mostly I actually quite like the music in games, but I've had a few songs on uh, Diablo 3 that um, just grated on me, man. Using a wrong instrument or it's just tense with the wrong instrument. I'm trying to raise the tension badly. Ooh, that's the boat that we want. The second one of is it is it a yang? It's not a yang. I can't carry any more. I am returning to town. Uskang, I think. Or Klakai. <laughs> Been busy, Bastion. keep it needs my help. Okay. Ah, that's the bargain. It's time to do. Who's coming? I kind of like because like that Iskang uh, doesn't have any like uh, legendary powers. Uh, but what I was saying is I kind of like what they do in Path of Exile, and it has some weird uh, weird power that doesn't sound like a lot because most most of the uniques in Path of Exile has some downside. So most people just like ah oh, downside's too much. But if you can focus on the one upside and combine it with a few other items that actually make it super powerful, then you can actually make a reasonable build out of stuff, even if they're not mainstream items that everyone wants. Find the portal to a tomb. This cannot be opened yet. Darkness awaits you. Okay, I'm actually triggering all these bosses, so it's probably worth me just actually instead of having to kill all the things, just triggering it and then running away and can trigger the others, otherwise I might run out of power. Come on, why am I stuck here? Walls! Where's my cools? Oh, run, 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 run. And I'm not getting the gold. Let me just trigger that. There we go. Kill the remaining enemies. Nice. Do you want more? Yeah, I was just sticking around trying to kill all the enemies. They were slowing me down, man. Risking me not finishing the bounty successfully. I know you can still finish it, you just can't, don't get the bonus chest. Okay, uh, map one is done. Room sign. Just looking to see if the 
the Necrat Key Warden is on a quest as well. Which it is not. Realm of Tractured Fate. One twenty eight minutes. Okay. One to the Diablo is the boss aspect of hatred. Yeah, instead of bounties, usually there's one boss and one, um, usually one boss and one clear um, level two type dungeon as well. The rules around what triggers it. It used to be the rules. Take it and let's go and 
Say hello to Diablo. Ooh, is that the, oh, the Oculus ring? I need that for my uh, for my minion. It helps uh, create a. It still triggers the the bonus effect on that, uh, which creates a um, a ring where you deal, deal more damage. You can still move and stand in there, it's on the ground. How much uh, death breath have I got? I have 463. I guess it becomes a bit more uh, common. Okay, the wrong way. Um, I guess it becomes more common the higher uh, torment you form at. I haven't had to use too much of it yet. Use this for a few. Um, yeah, when I uh, take stuff, uh, reforge legendaries, uh, not reforge, extract their powers. Dead. I'm still here. I see you more powerful. I did not drop the death stress because they weren't all dead yet. The burden has to get out of here. Into the crystal arch and it killed by a blow. Oh, we'll come back for the goodies. We'll come back for the goodies. Stack them up. Stack them up. In less than sixty seconds. Can come quick, quick. That is good enough. Quick, quick. I'm still waiting. Ah, you never died, man. You never died. So close. Look at all this damage I deal in. Pram cut. You go, Templar. You go. Show him his boss. Turn to Tilly Keep up the reward. I am returning to town. Hmm. Okay. Well, good on gold. <laughs> So far, I don't know what it cost at the high end of stuff. Uh, great rift to empower if you want to see empower or not. The boar's ring, Rachel's, uh, Rachel's ring of larceny gain 55% increased movement speed for 4 seconds after fearing an enemy. You could probably combine this with that. Is it a ring that fears them on hit, like 20% chance to fear them on hit? Maybe. Because then that explodes and fears enemy 
enemies hit by the explosion. So they can almost have a lot of that. Uh, we will save that in our disenchant list. Oh, look at that. Attack speed critical hit. I know this is... Obsidian a Ring of the Zodiac is not what we were after. Let's save that. Uh, Natalia's Embrace. Now I'll wait for that. Hey, I know we have it. Uh, da -da 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 -da. It's fine. In this box of goodies. Boots and a hammer. Boots of disregard gain 10,000 life for regen per second for each second you stand full. This effect backs up to four times. Mad Monarch Scepter. Okay, let me salvage. This forgotten cells are at 157. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to see that and uh, some Paragon points. And that was Act 4 and then Act 3. But oh, wait, Act 4 needs a Key Warden fight. He needs to donate his keys to us. <laughs> The charity man, no. Yes. Okay. That was key warden back to act three. Let's get that key warden. And we can continue the last act bounties. And do some rifting. Was just a trade. Bleed, you filth. For those players who don't know, we used to um, have to farm goblins to get access to um, the Greed's Domain for the first time to get the Boon of the Order. And uh, it used to be quite a farming process because it's totally chance based um, whether a particular goblin out in the wild will actually drop you a uh, portal to Greed's Domain. I'm not sure if the puzzle ring recipe was always in the game and it add, was added later to actually get to the domain as well. 
to tap it. It definitely helps make it a little bit easier. And Path of Exile can keep still keep running when the map overlays on there isn't a proper map like this. Um it's an overlay. But you can still keep running. It's a free to play game if you guys are interested. In, uh, Path of Exile is an action RPG. Um, more in the style of Diablo 2 than Diablo 3. But it's a, s a slow burn RPG, you don't get rewarded as quickly as you do in Diablo. For Diablo 3 at least. Jeez, I'm running all the way around. Man. Unless there was actually... Uh, I could have gone straight and then turned right. Probably why I'm going all the way around. Yep. That's going to be the route. The tile sit. So go around the long way. <laughs> okay, and here we kill all the enemies. That's your friend? No? That one? No? Out of that garden here. Yeah? Seventeen items, I crushed it. Oh man, now I've missed the enemies. Now I have to go back all the way to find out where they are. <sighs> okay. This is what I don't like about these ones. Is finding those and missing enemies somewhere. Are they in the center somewhere? Should bring up the um, skull icons for them somewhere. I 
This is like in the very first room. Oh no, there they are. Uh. Okay. Uh, Bridge of Korshik, kill Emberwing. Let's do that one. Kill Emberwing. 150 enemies. Ooh, that will count as well. Okay. I'm still uh, wasn't a quantity one. I'm just going to kill these mobs. Fifty enemies in the fields of slaughter. I'm giving a good uh, name for that field. Showing the name is a good uh, name. Fields of slaughter. Slaughter on the edge. So I'll turn you down and see what we get. Maybe this one is the one we want. Maybe. Maybe. Still a good one. It's uh, Compass Rose. If we get, oh, have we got a Traveler's Pledge? Because that's the other one. Uh, no, don't think I've got a Traveler's Pledge. No. No. That might be worth. Um, while I'm waiting, if I get the the necklace, the Traveler's Pledge before I get the focus and restraint combination I might go with those just for a while because it does a um, what's the bonus? while moving damage taken is reduced by up to 50% so uh, if you keep moving you take less damage but while standing still damage dealt is increased by up to 100% so it doesn't have this um, full on 50% damage taken I have damage reduced but increased damage dealt while standing still so if you're at range you're standing still and shooting this could help maybe that combined with the uh, elusive ring maybe if we don't do focus and restraint so focus and restraint requires a spender and a shooter this one doesn't really matter as long as you keep moving and then standing still when you're doing damage it's a uh, swinging uh, counter that's like uh, once you start moving it goes up to 50 slowly like well, fairly quickly but it's minus 52 plus 100 um, well, I think it's two separate counters so up to 50 is one counter so damage reduced taken when, when you're moving and once you're standing still that drops back down and while standing still again that's a counter then that goes up to 100 for increased damage uh, let's do drop that, drop that, drop that. and fields of slaughter let's go finish that fields of slaughter the ballistics helps as well, I think, because the ballistic skill. Uh, I think. Ballistic skills, why are you doing this? 
So ballistics. Uh, increased damage of rockets and have 20% chance to fire a homing rocket for 150% weapon damage when you attack. So that helps a bit on damage as well. Golash to there. Okay, let's go and kill Golash. Golash is killed. Regular of minions. Champion pack and lead pack? Oh. Oh, luckily this one is like right right there. Right there, man. I'm just a scout. What was supposed to fight still? Ooh. Need a goblin as well. Yeah, there we go. Bloodshot goblin, thank you. I'm still here. Zor, Basso. Watch out! He was little more than a boy. He was little more than a boy. Not fair. Okay. Uh, and last one today. Boss fight. And then we can do some Nephilim rifts and get some key stories. looking for a manticore as well for my other build the sentry uh, build for the marauders because it, use, it uses grenades um, and manticore is pretty good for the grenades build sentries sentries and grenades Let's 
is kill Sedea at level 70 without taking damage from the spider links on torment 3 difficulty or higher. Okay. I am returning to town. Cool. Not anything that looks super exciting. You have done well. Red War Tapestry. Prides fall. Your resource costs are reduced by 30% after not taking damage for 30 seconds. Overwhelming desire. Kitty Chanson. Okay. Oculus Ring. So this is the one that I wanted because it creates that, that second, uh, secondary effect. Chance to create an area of focus power on killing a monster damaged. Damage is increased by 76% while standing in the area. There's only an occasional thing that happens when you put it on the minion, but you can then go and jump in there yourself because the minion generates that socket. So let's swap out. What have we got? So we still got the. Uh, sorry, this one. We still got Unity in there, but we can swap out the Unity. Maybe the word ward. Because the unity we're still using. Let's swap the we we have the ward. Ah, good. And hold on off on the, the unity. Uh Castirian, gold skin, chance for enemies to drop gold when you hit them. Pass better or depth digger. That. Okay, do to go to go salvage some stuff. Oops, salvage. And some paragon points. So we now have, uh, let me check my inventory. We now have about 39. 38 at the least of each of the um, bounty materials. So, uh, let me see what the recipes are. We still want, we can probably do that now, gamble for a helm to try and get the, you look like you could use um, a new item of, uh, the outstanding one, which is the useful. visage of Gunz. What a steal. Don't forget, luck always changes. My pack is full. Not a message of Goons. The Oryx Crown is good. The Oryx Crown, Broken Crown is good. Okay. Not yet, not yet. It is a helm, right? Demon Hunter doesn't have a specific. Let's Just like this is a cloak, actually. I said cloak rather than a helm. Helm, pants, bracer, shield, no. trinket, and it's. Helm. See you soon. That is too expensive. No. Okay. We want visage of goons. Okay. Let's do some. Nephilim Rift, how many keys have we put? We've got five keys, so not a lot. Um, I just want to check something uh, on the difficulty charts. Because, uh, difficulty. Uh, the reason I'm checking this is even T14 uh, feels a bit uh, easy. Okay, yeah, T15 is a bit of a jump because it doubles in the monster health. And in terms of a legendary drop rate, um, it's only 1.2 better. Okay. 
Okay. Yeah, I think I'm fine on Torment of 14 for the time being. So we get that uh, last ring at least. Looking for the focus on the restraint. We've got two focus rings, but we need a restraint. Called farming opportunity with this uh, key farming as the gold farming opportunity as well. Even T14 feels a little bit easy because they have to kill stuff. Might be worth jumping to T15. Even if it triples the monster health. It doubles the monster health. I might kill them. Cheers, this could Oh yeah, I've got squirts again. So this is a squirt thing that's counting up if I take damage. But I also deal more damage. Take and deal more damage. But the gold trap. I mean, what's up? Why is it I didn't even see which one it was. <laughs> I just killed it. Finish a level 70 Nephilim Rift on Torment 6 difficulty or higher within 4 minutes. Torment 6 or higher within 3 minutes. I need to speed up, man. Ah, puzzle ring. I'll take the puzzle ring. Cloak Cape, Aquilus, Nagel Ring, a fallen lunatic to your side. Vigilante belt, okay. Not super exciting. And we will save as the puzzle room. So we can comfortably take on uh, the boss and T16s. Are 
you strong enough to survive the trial? I'm still here. Too quickly, too quickly, I need more time. Just catch my breath. Where are we going? I'm still waiting. Okay. This way? Oh, this way. You can't survive now. Yeah, I saw the um, the rates of primals and ancients. So ancients is about ten percent of uh, normal legendary drop rate, and primals are point two two percent or something of legendaries. So one in ten of ancients could be a primal ancient. So for every ten ancients you get, you might get the one final. Is that right? No, it's even less. So it's one in every fifty. One in every fifty. This is a good uh, death breath area. Need more time. Fight on, fight on, goodies, 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 everywhere, goodies, look at all these goodies, man. That's the dead end of the game. I'm still waiting. No, I don't know, I don't know. No, that was Good loot, pretty good haul of loot. 
Your skill has grown. Thank you, Ori. My skill has grown. And to continue to clear out this one. So, it's of Johan, another gold trap. Restraint! There we go. So, focus on the restraint. We can swap around. And uh, Hellcat Waste Card. Ooh. Grenades have a chance to bounce five times. Blah, blah, blah. So that's also needed for my uh, an advanced build, uh, the grenades build. Open that one. Shadows Grass. Black Feather Tower Randon's Hand. Cold Zap. Let's hold on to a Cold Zap for now. Uh, let's put it in there. Focus and restraint. Let's keep him there. It's not a very good one. Uh, it's got a socket, but we'd want a, um, a few damage rolls. <laughs> crit, crit damage, attack speed, cooldown reduction, anything like that. Um, and what do we have here? This is cool. Uh, these are cost of fire skills. We can save that. Gladiator, Shadow's Grasp. We do have Shadow's Grasp. This one's slightly better. Okay, and your other one is of Johan. Now we have one saved. Let's have one in my uh, Disenchant box. Disenchant. But is of your own is just good for the um, the follower that's the tank because it just pulls in in all the enemies around into him, so you can focus fire on all of them. So you could all that. Okay, let's keep going. Uh, do we want to change focus on the strength? We want how much? We still want the the cow, like the visage of goons. Or the other defensive thing before we I wish you change. Luck. set up again. But that might allow us to do the complete Give shift to uh, torment. We'll see. We can uh, up the difficulty one to uh, torment fifteen. See how that is. The last one would be torment fifteen. Ah, uh, sorry, Tom and 16. I do quite uh, like that they act actually added those extra difficulties. A little bit of extra challenge. Then uh, I can actually start looking for for ancients rather than just the actual normal item. I'd like I'd like to get an ancient um, bow. Replace my Yang Sriker with an ancient version. Traveler's Pledge? No, it's Blackthorns. Ah man, they should do something with the Blackthorn set. I think it's such a waste of opportunity because at the moment, even last time I looked at this, look at this. What is the bonus of the Blackthorn set, right? Because the only class agnostic set, and what does it give us? Uh, bonus. 250 volts increases damage against elites by 10 and reduces damage by 10. You are immune to the escape the Molten and Plague. 
compared to all the other sets that gives like thousands of percent damage. Uh, 350 per point of discipline, so times 83 times 350 percent. And this is just, uh, yeah, all those special effects doesn't hurt you. Such a small part of damage though, because those are all normally avoidable anyway. I'm wondering, right, if this, um, that was just a thing. this class set bonus, right, gives you generators, multi shot, and vengeance. Deal 350% increased damage for every point of discipline you have. But we also fire rockets, right? Does those rockets then also increase damage? I assume they do, because they do do quite a lot even if I don't shoot stuff. Like I was fighting in the other direction and it was just rockets that do dealt with that damage. Like if I fire the other direction my rockets can do most of the damage as well. To understand the mechanics of the fight man. of the class. Your fear betrays you. As well, I will take all of the, all of the champion back. Thank you. Need more time. Need more time. Not ready yet. Not bloody yet. Sweet revenge. Oh, I'll take it. I will take it. Thank you. It's my uh, gold situation. Two billion. I looked at the lo lifetime uh, gold collector stat, and it's about thirty-seven billion or something. So lots of uh, scope for improvement. <laughs> Played ten seasons or ten different seasons. I'm still waiting. Skip the season here and there. I haven't played all of them. Feel my wrath. Not ready yet. Hmm. Not teleported. I want the primal enchant. The red, the red ones, the red ones. Come on. Three great red key stones. More uh, rares. There we go. Very open map. Should usually have a few rares lurking about. Vengeance! Oh, take that. 
Okay. Well, I think I've got a different class that looks like the mage said helm, if I remember correctly. I grant you the power of your answer. The Star of Asgrant. A pretty rare one. So for that. To be salvaged. Rondal's Locket, nothing for me. Sword of Ill Will. Ninth, ninth City Satchel. Uh, Firebird's Plume. Fierce Gauntlet. Wizard as well. Wizard, Wizard. Uh, which one? Natalia's. Oh, Marauders. That's my first actual set. Ancient one, I think. Yeah. So slowly uh, I go through and upgrade the sets to Marauders, uh, to Ancients where I've got it. Okay. Can't raise the difficulty. Let me try this. Uh, no. Now I'm near the end of my stream for tonight, so I'm going to do one more um, greater rift, and then I am going to call the stream. So let's do this. Stay where we are. And then tomorrow we can up the difficulty again, because then we've got a focus and restraint. And that should be my criteria. Trying to get. Visits of goons as well. Oh, this white armor man does help with um, the plane. Um, plain magic ingredients. And it gives you a lot more per piece than e either of the yellows or blues. Dramatic music, man. Is there a goblin? Blood shards, nice. Turns into 64, just from that. Might run out of storage space <laughs> picking up all these weights. Yeah. We are very soon near the end of our storage space. I meant to pick up this many weights.
Okay. Oh, this might be a good one. Yep. Uh, let's quickly clear inventory. Salvage, salvage, salvage. Save the goodies for later. going to be a one level thing. Circle of Death. Okay, that was the last one. Let's see if we can get lucky with the helm that we want by chanting at Kadal. Is that now that there? Let's talk to Kadal. My father was a great man until he lost. That will look nice on you. Do you come back again? I can't carry any more. Not yet. Lost. Are you ready? Batch of helms. See you soon. See you we soon. cannot afford that. No. The short answer is no. Marauders and Accursed. Shadows Mask. Let's see. That sounded like it was a new one because it gave me the set bonus. Yes. Yeah, shadows Mask. And that's all Shadow, 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 Shadow. Okay. So this one can be disenchanted. And Marauder's Visage, Dex Life, Cluster Arrow. Dex Life, Elemental Arrow. That's fine. Uh, Accursed Visage. That there. I would like to get a full set of extras, then I can reforge them to try and get them uh, to Ancients as well, if I need to. Um, it might be cheaper just to uh, reforge stuff that's very rare drop chance because these ones you can get fairly regularly just by spending blood shards at Kadala. Um, 
we will see, we will see. Um, this is, hold on, is this one better than I've got? I like, like the 14% life. So it would give me 32% toughness, but I lose crit chance. Uh, okay, let's look at this. Nemesis Natalia's. So I have one. Demon's Demise and Thrill. Okay, this can be salvaged. Uh, I want to hold that onto that though. It's our current one. Current one is called Skill Dex Armor Life Bird. Uh, our current one's pretty good. But it will allow us to reforge as well. So let's hold onto that. Okay, um, that's what I'm going to call the stream tonight. I had some fun doing some bounties and some great drifts. Uh, I've got a bunch of um, bounty materials. Oh, 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 the scroll. Uh, I've got a bunch of bounty materials. Um, 38 at the least. And I've got at least, at least one Ramalatni's gift. And I've got a few extra stuff here, a ring of a royal grandeur. So I could now change this one out and this one out to be the um, focus and restraint because that's going to give me the up to 100% increased damage as well. These two are, this one wasn't doing anything, it was just for the set, which I can now put in there. And Elusive Ring was defensive, but um, after using a Vault. So I need to get the Visage of Goons in there defensively to help as well. Because I'm sw swapping out Unity. Um, oh, that's going to lose a lot actually. Because that's 52% and Unity is 50% as well. Uh, damage a reduction. But it will give me increased. So my current toughness 62 million. It should give me increased uh, damage. So I should be able to take on T16. Um, anyway, that's for Thursday. Uh, I take Wednesdays off. So if you enjoyed hanging out in the stream. And watching me play Diablo 3. I will be back on Thursday. I think I'm going to keep playing this week, uh, Thursday and Friday, till Diablo 3. And then on the weekend, I'll probably jump back into Pov XL to see if I can make progress there. I'm about tier 10 maps, uh, still farming for tier 11 maps. Uh, and then we will see how we feel next week, whether we continue doing this or go on to a new game. Uh, but thanks for hanging out. I will see you on Thursday. Take care. Bye.